hard to breathe, but that's alright. Hush. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and the continuation of the Espana campaign. As we started with the Kingdom of Leon, then the Kingdom of Castile, and gradually grew to take over all of Spain, we are now owning great swathes of the map, with 110,000 troops to call upon, a great reserve of gold, and the new emperor looking to make his mark after the great lineage of his father and his grandmother. So I hope you're all still enjoying the Spanish playthrough, and if you'd like to see more and are enjoying the series, then please do consider leaving a like and subscribing to the channel. All your support really does help us and it allows us to continue to grow, and thank you for your continued support throughout. It's been really very, very kind and lovely to see. So, without further ado, are we happy with all of our men-at-arms? We've got two armoured horsemen, we've got a pikeman. We haven't really got any... Oh, we've got one crossbow, okay. And we've got one caballeros. That's pretty much all we can do, isn't it? Yeah. That is pretty much all we can do do what have we got in terms of here can't go on a pilgrimage can't do any of that business alrighty how are we for factions there is actually a bit of a sizable uh, independence faction something that we need to work on definitely most definitely uh, that's oh, super helpful I've got too many held duchies. I know I need to get rid of Gascoigne. I know. I'm loath to, but we do need to. I'm waiting till my son and heir comes of age. Which is going to be a while, it has to be said. But nevertheless. It would be great to have some more uh, children, actually. I know we're trying to romance my wife, but I'm, I'm just slightly concerned by this. Their discontentment's going down, which is good. But... Oh, God, we've got a big Liberty faction as well. Blimeneck. Emperor, what's going on? Don't be the one to have it unravel. That's all I ask. How much does your lands have you got for us? Three... I am at least now known for my dedication to faith, which is wonderful. Um, if we have to, we'll pay some vassals. I'm hopeful that we, we won't actually have to do that, but we'll wait and see. I guess whilst we've got this, we could invest in it. If there's worthwhile investments to be made plus it might suit our son better if we at least give him a half decent um, inheritance so let's go ahead and do that splendid people are liking us I mean are we still suffering from short rule I'm sure we probably are yeah, 12 and short reign. Need a new... Uh... Oh, it's annoying that you're not very good. But I'm going to have to put you in. Unfortunately. I know I still have too many held barracks, but... It'll fade. So they needn't worry. Uh, Holy Roman Empire. What have we got against you? I've got... Du jour duchy I can take. That gives me three. Tyrol gives me... Probably only one. So yeah, there's not a great deal for us to be taking. 
unfortunately. Maybe some better claims elsewhere. That's not bad. One, two, that's still only three. That's three. I mean, we have taken good chunks from them already, so I'm not uh, not too surprised. In fairness, what about Poland? Can I take a duchy from Poland? Mm, not really. It's only going to be a county. Do we have a court physician? We do have a court physician. He's not particularly good. But I have got one. Right. Try and earn some favour with him. Good stuff. Ransom him. So I've got two years until I can do any of that. Liberty faction's going down. Independence faction's... Yeah, it's going down. But there are still some strong members in it. So I still need to be conscious of it. Malaga's fine. You're fine. Granada's fine. God, we build so quickly now. I guess it's because we've got the architect trait, to be fair. And it is a good trait, don't get me wrong. I just wanted to prioritise other things at the outset, but we will carry on with what he has given us. Interesting conversation, because that gives us some prestige and diplomacy bonuses. You want me to increase opinion with the King of France? I would love to do that too, but quite frankly, it's not going to happen, is it? Finland's big. When did you get so big, Finland? A little surprising. Okay, no one's got any big claims there. Has anyone got any claims for Ireland? No claims in Ireland. No claims in Galloway, and no claims in Scotland. So we might have to forge our own claims there if we need to. I'm sure we won't need to, but... Don't need the gold, so let's do that. I've obtained lost knowledge, that's fine. It's not a problem at all. Conscription in Granada. So I'm getting lots of additional troops from all of this. Do we want to go to war with someone? Could go to war with you. 7,000 troops, that's not bad. Might give us some piety, maybe. We'll raise some local levies, see what we get. Should be sufficient, I would hope. He gets 7k, so that's... Oh, actually. He's already up to 8. Okay. Yeah, we're going to have more, more than enough. I just need to be conscious that I can't have a feast or a hunt for a while. And we will suffer... That penalty for having an offensive war. But let's see what comes of it. How is my son doing? Uh, he's coming on well. He's only one, so he's doing alright. Still need to try and romance you, don't I? It says 100% success rate, so let's give it a go. Give it a nice, good effort and go. Yeah, we still need to work on this faction stuff. 
but it would be good to expand a little bit because he is how old is he he's 47 but he's in very good health he should last us for a long time actually if we're lucky and he doesn't get ill or anything did he get the crusader perk oh he did good job Nice, she's grateful for that. I think we'll get them. Just about. Brother can have... Ambitious is better. And then go and take his capital for us. You have finished converting the faith. Adamite. Ooh, no thank you. Do not wish that. Seems like some other faiths are creeping through. Faiths that we do not want. Can I imprison that man? Yes, I think I would like to, actually. But he's not going to uh, follow the correct faith, and we're going to have a problem. If you would convert, I would release you. And we'll take that. Good. So at least he's converted. Which should help with dealing with that faith. Are you of that faith as well? Right. Not on convert if you don't I'll imprison you and absolutely not I'm not paying for your salvation you will do it or you will be thrown into the dungeon good and it looks like they're coming in to attack me as I siege their town. But that'll do. Wasn't too hard of a uh, thing to try and do. And we can grant this to... Uh, yeah, let's give it to my brother and knight, shall we? And then if he wants, whatever the duchy is, I'll give him that too. There you go, my friend. Congrats. Do you want to be in alliance? You don't want to be in alliance. Okay. But that's fine. Nice, we actually won the duel, that's good. Bordeaux, what can we upgrade for you? Uh, I think upgrade the castle maybe. Ah, uh, no, we can upgrade this. My son doesn't need the best best, but we'll invest as much as is reasonable, I would say. Give him a good economy so that he can crack on. Still no hunt, still no feast just yet. I'm hoping soon this romance scheme will be over. Um, go on, let's see if we can lose some stress. Ugh, we didn't lose the stress, that's sad.
my dear, dear son. Who is now the tender age of two. Still got a long way to go, bless him. Proposed alliance. Grand Prince of Pinsk. Sure, you can have an alliance with me. Why the devil not? And he's charming. Oh, good man. Good young son. Okay, let's go for that. And let's try and save our wife. Okay, we've got act of heroism. Oh, is she ill? Oh, no, let's hope she survives. She's got reduced symptoms, at least. Despite the fact... I don't think he's particularly good, is he? And we'll get that. Does Almira need anything? We can get that. So we're earning 250 a month. It's pretty extravagant. I've got the Kingdom of Sicily, which actually does own a good stonk of Italy. I've got vassals that are fairly equally matched, which is helpful for us. Because no one is out there with a massive, great big stack. We've got vassals that are fairly evenly keeled. Right, we need to be conscious of this. Independence faction. The romance thing worked, which is great. I definitely need to sway you. And if I can have a feast... Oh, beautiful, perfect timing. We will enjoy that feast now. Uh, yeah, we'll have a alliance with you, why not? You'll be cheap to call in. Welcome everyone to the feast. Hopefully you will all enjoy. Take this gold. Oh, no. I'm not paying to win my vassal's favour. I know we've got gold to spare, but I'm not going to be doing that. Um, yeah, we don't want anyone to seduce us. We're going to stay faithful to our wife. Because we've just romanced her and she's considered our soulmate. So that's what we're going to do. And look at that, she's pregnant. Give her household efforts as well. Just make her a very happy bunny. Beautiful, we picked up Eagle Reveler, that might help us. I mean, there is still some discontent here. Unfortunately. But we will try our best to get rid of that discontent. My uncle and vassal, we can have an alliance, go for it. Can't. Oh, can have a hunt as soon as this is done. Oh, what did we just inherit? The Duchy of Upland. I definitely don't want that. Yeah, I really don't want that. So. Um, what's, what's the county of Kinder? Ah, oh, so we have areas in Sweden anyway. Okay. I have Upland. I don't want it. All yours, brother. To be fair, we could go to war with Norway. How are they allied to bloody Ghana? That's a bit absurd, isn't it? That's not a bad war for us. Yes. So, is this because... Have you just joined me? I think Sweden might have just joined us. 
I don't think we had a Wolf Sweden before. Yeah, because he's now joined this and tilted it. Okay, well, we'll have our hunt. <sighs> They're all annoyed because I have too many duchies. I'm also way above the vassal limit. Mm -mm. Okay, well, let's see who might be reporting to me. Right. You need to go to France. In all honesty. You need to go to him. Uh, France, you should also have... What? What have you got that you don't currently have? You go to him. Champagne goes to him. Okay, so... Hmm... For the most part, you've got half decent. Who... Oh, we don't actually have a steward in place. Okay, that's bad. What's your annoyance? You want this duchy. Okay. Why are you on that duchy? I guess it's the sure part of yours. Alright, I'll give it to you. I will give you him. Happy? Happy bunny. Happy for days, that's good. King of... Okay, I'm going to swap you then. Swap C's with you. Go to... 11, reassign Cordoba, appoint King of Burgundy, so that gives him happiness. Now I've still got some vassals that need to be given away. King of Brittany, I think, yeah, you're kind of it. I haven't got any kings in Spain. Ideally would like to keep it that way. You are part of what? Kingdom of Tahert. We don't have a king in Tahert, so let's make one. Who would like to be the king of Tahert? Probably this young duke. Zab though is quite big. But I will give you the kingdom. There you go. And then, what have you got? So you've got that. That's part of Aragon. The Duchy of Zab, I feel like you should have. The fact that he's got Navarra is just a little bit of a pain, but you can have him. So there you go. What else needs some movement... Uh, you need to have definitely that. Ah, they're in a war, so I can't give you that. And Kona. Who do you answer to? You answer directly to me. You should probably answer to Sicily. Let's just be honest. There you go. What else? Uh, I've got Burgundy, I don't know what is part of de jour Burgundy, France has had enough, I don't want to give them any more power, <laughs> Aquitaine's a bit funny, this is part of Aquitaine anyway isn't it, you might as well have this, I know I've invested a bit in it but If the vassals are complaining, then we might as well just give the stuff away. That's done us quite well when it comes to this. Uh, I guess I'm trying to sway you already. That's good. 
you folks are all fairly happy. Duchess Anna, just like me. We just need folks to like us, guys. Just like us. We're not... We're not unfriendly folk. We could pick that up. Every knight would gain some favour of us. Let's do that. Bit of a management episode this, but that is always very much worthwhile doing. That would give us four. That would be quite good. Take us more away towards Jerusalem. Which is actually quite thick. We've got the three kingdoms. Mesopotamia. I can found a university. So let's do that. That gives me the scholarly title. Still slightly above the vassal limit. Um, we do want to earn favour with him. So we'll take the hit. No war in Wales. Ugh, one county in England's just not worth anything to us. Ooh, that's more like it. That's what we want. A nice chunk of Ireland would be pretty nice. Nowhere really with great infrastructure. What's your supply limit? Dublin's all right. Let's raise some troops in Dublin, shall we? Might be a tad slow, but... God, lots of vassals to be granted. Okay. This is why Sweden's cheesed off with me. Here you go, Sweden. Have all of your vassals so that at least you'll be a happy bunny. And that also deals with my... ...problem of having too many direct vassals. So that's worked out jolly well. Uh, Manrique, why don't you become... Ugh, oh, fine, just keep Craven. You're a half-brother, you're not that important to me. This place can get a little bit more investment. Because that's going to go to my son so that he can enjoy some time as a well earning duke. Good news. There's nothing much more for you to do. I need a new spy master. My uncle's pretty great. Oh, we took that already. Right. Go and take more. I didn't even realise we'd taken his capital. Sorry, that was uh, a bit blinding. So this siege shouldn't take us too, too long. Still says I've got too many held duchies. Do I still own Leon? I don't own the duchy of Leon. But we do own it as a county. Which... In all honesty, there isn't much point in us having. But we'll take it because we need to. And it gives us some income. So in fairness, it's, it's not... It's nothing to be shunned at. Let's put it that way. Uh, I can also work off some stress, but we're not really stressed. I would like a better physician, though. If we can get one. Simon actually has 
some experience, so let's pick him up. How long is your siege going to take? Four months. I think we've got plenty of time to siege this castle and then go for you. Uh, meanwhile, how am I doing? Do I need to upgrade this? Uh, not much point in upgrading the fort. I could upgrade that for the troop count. This will also give us a little bit of income. Seeing as he is an architect after all, we should make the most of it if he's got it. Ooh. Who wants to claim the throne? My uncle. He's got 20k troops. He could get some wind in his boots if he chose to. Don't think he will, but he could do. We certainly don't want him to. Have you got the movement speed? You do not have the movement speed. Bonus. But I'm happy for you to proceed with what you have. Oh, go on, stop him. I don't think you will, will you? Eight days, seven, six, five, four, three. Oh, with four days left to go, we have stopped the Irish King. So, so sorry. I'd gain a bit of dread. And I will take your Irish lands. Look at that. Most of Ireland now is ours. Congrats to you, my new fearless duke. I have a rival in prison. What would happen if I were to execute my rival? I would gain prestige. I would spend piety. I would gain dread. But I would lose a bunch of stress. And I'd be considered a tyrant. So maybe not. Can I move him to the dungeon? We can move him to the dungeon. And he's more likely to die. Perfect. So a nice upgrade going all around for us. But with that, ladies and gentlemen, I think we will have to end the episode there. I hope you're still enjoying the Spain playthrough. A lot's been going on with it, in fairness. If you are enjoying it, then please do consider leaving a like and subscribing to the channel. It really does help us. In the meantime, though, I will see you all in the next episode. Hello.